Yo, what is up, Sex Beach Crazy Rabbit here, and today we're gonna be doing top five, and today's top five is top five things that I suck at most in zombies, so let's go to get the shit started. Coming in at number five is gonna be jumping off ledges, etc, etc. So if we go back to Die Rise, you guys know how much I love that, man, let me tell ya. I really suck at jumping in zombies just in general. Sometimes I always either jump too late or I jump too early, especially on Die Rise or anywhere with a really a far jump or like a ledge or something like that. I always end up fucking up on the jumping and I always either fall to my death or I'll get hit by a zombie right before I actually jump off. And then as soon as I land, I immediately die. So I really do suck at jumping in zombies. This is one of the reasons I always grab Flopper is just to be extra safe when I'm jumping off a especially high ledge that way I don't die because I just really bad at it. I'm really bad at the timing I can never get the timing right sometimes I'll press the jump button and my character's like you know what did you say go to prone I, I heard go to prone and my character will fucking go prone for some reason don't even understand how that one works but I really do suck at timing jumping in zombies I don't know why it's just jumping any other game I like even in multiplayer I'm pretty good at it but zombies I guess it's just a curse that I have that I cannot jump to save my life in zombies Alright, and coming at number 4 is going to be aiming for headshots. Now, I'm not really good at aiming for headshots. I really don't know why. I always just tend to aim for the body or spray. I never really aim down my sights and actually try to aim for headshots. I really don't know why I do this, but I always either just spray with the gun. I never really ADS that much. But when I actually do aim down sights, I usually just aim for the stomach. This is probably because I want to get as most points as possible. Usually on high rounds, you try to aim for like the middle of the zombies. That way you can get as most points as possible because we all know on high rounds, even if you're aiming for the head, it's probably not going to do anything. So that's probably why I never really aim for the head and I probably just spray all the time is because I'm stupid and I treat early rounds the same thing as far rounds because I am dumb. Alright, and coming in number three is going to be explosives. So I am terrible with explosives. I cannot tell you how many times I have killed myself with grenades, just like throwing the grenade and then being a dumbass and then running into said grenade. I've done that surprisingly a lot. I've also killed myself with like the China Lake and a lot of other explosives because I shoot them too close to my feet. This is another reason I'm kind of dependent on Flopper. I really do enjoy my Floppy, man. I really love Flopper for the no fall damage and I also love it for the explosive damage, even though I never really get any explosives. I mean, I get the ray gun every now and then, but generally I tend to stay away from explosives, mainly because it's just a hassle you really don't get that many points and just does nothing but create crawlers but the main reason i love flopper for the explosive damage is because it protects me from me being a dumbass and throwing grenades like if i throw a simtex on a wall but my timing is just so terrible i'll run by that wall and that simtex explodes and that usually ends up damaging me a lot or actually killing me so very bad with explosives the timing for me it's a timing thing i don't know why that isn't zombies i'm just very very bad at timing no idea why i just suck at it. i need to go like to timing school or something Alright, and coming in number two is going to be, this might sound really dumb, but early rounds. So there's one thing in zombies that I am, I am definitely impatient as fuck, especially on maps that I absolutely love. Like, if I'm playing on Moon, Darice, Ascension, Kino, one of those maps that I absolutely love, I cannot stand being on early rounds like 1 through 10, because it just goes by so slow, and I'm just like, can I just start on round 20? Just throw me on round 20, and I'll immediately start from there and just start getting my stuff done. Like, I just cannot stand having to find that one zombie that's just walking around the map. I absolutely hate that, and this always causes me to go down because I'll try to just, you know, hurry up and end the round because I'm so impatient. I'll try to double knife a zombie after I get swiped. It usually causes me to go down, like, a lot, like, on round four or five just because I'm so impatient that I really want to end these rounds real quick. And I'm trying to whore up as many points as I can, so I generally end up doing something stupid, like knifing a zombie right after he hits me. So this is why I go down a lot on early rounds just because I'm so damn impatient. I want to get to the rounds I want to get to. I want to get my setup going. I'm just too damn impatient to play hide-and-go-seek with that one zombie that just likes to walk around the map. And coming in number one, the thing that I suck most at in zombies is teamwork. So this is why I always play solo, because a lot of people think, I personally don't think, I think I'm like a great team player, but a lot of people seem to think that I'm a terrible team player in zombies. And the reason for this is because my belief in zombies is that I shouldn't have to babysit you. When I'm playing as a team, if I'm playing with four people, my job is to not babysit you. Your job is to stay alive. My job is to stay alive and kill zombies. That's your job. My job is to not babysit you and make sure you don't go down. But a lot of people don't share that with me, and a lot of people think that it's my job to make sure that nobody goes down for some reason, and that even if they go down, I have to revive them regardless, and I have to just take care of their zombies, and that's just now how I see zombies. I see zombies as every man for himself. If I can get you, I can get you. If I can't, I can't. You should take care of yourself. I should take care of myself. I don't expect you to get me. I don't expect me to get you. That's how I see zombies, and that's probably why I play solo a lot, because I'd only like to rely on myself. I don't want to have to rely on other players' skill to get to high rounds. I'd rather just rely on myself, so if I fuck up, I know it's my fault. But if my teammate fucks up and that causes me to go down, oh, I'm going to be pissed. I'm going to be extremely pissed. But that's probably what I suck at most in zombies is teamwork. I would just rather have it be me solo all the time, but, I mean, a lot of Easter eggs you can't, so that really kind of sucks. Treyarch, you know, get on that, make solo Easter eggs a thing now. But yeah, so those are the top five things I suck at most in zombies. I'm very curious to know, what do you guys suck at in zombies? Put it in the comments, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.